Hey, it's Livy Davis here with Miss Summers with Medical Training College. If you're interested, maybe thinking about starting a career as a massage therapist, this is an inside look at what one of the classrooms here at Medical Training College looks like. Miss Summers, can you tell us about the room that we're in right now and what a student could expect? Yes, this is our spa lab. We have one. We have the only spa lab in the Baton Rouge area, oh, wow. and this is where students learn how to do the salt glows, sugar scrubs. Uh, they do a lot of the. Uh, modalities that would require uh, wet tables as you can see we have okay. wet tables and we use steamy wonder and we use the hot stones and wow. and uh, all the uh, elements of that spa uh, experience that a person would get at a spa. Perfect so if somebody's looking to go and you know maybe working at a spa or a salon as a massage therapist they would really learn everything they need to know as a massage therapist kind of in a room like this here at Medical Training Yes, College. yes they would. Perfect. Can't wait to you know have one of the students give, a, give me a massage <laughs> after they complete the program. Yeah girl, they, uh, a lot of our massage therapists are out there working in spas and salons and uh, some of the uh, bigger massage establishments like um, Massage Envy, I don't know if I can say that. That's okay. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> um, but our massage therapists also work in uh, health centers, and they can gravitate more toward the medical end of massage, working with physical therapists and chiropractors as well. Do you know of a percentage of how many students really take to medical offices when they graduate and go to work there? Well, a lot of our students do go to work for the chiropractic mm -hmm. offices and the physical therapy offices, working with those medical professionals in the overall health care of their patients. Um, offering the services that the chiropractor can't do, the soft tissue mobilization and those types of things that the massage therapist has the advantage of. Right. So they work, they, they hire the massage therapist to do that part of the treatment um, that they cannot offer on their own. And you don't think about that. You really don't think about the medical portion of a massage therapist. Like I said, you always think about going to a salon, going to a fitness center, but it's really important in helping people recover from car accidents, you know, injuries on the job, anything like that. The massage therapist can probably really help out with that, huh? Absolutely. Um, it is an allied healthcare profession and massage therapists play an important role in the overall rehab process. Um, muscles get tight and uh, uh, cause pain and that's what massage therapy does, offers that relief. Okay, you, you gotta help me out. What is this? A tent? I mean, you put this in the backyard? What, what, what can people do with this right here? <laughs> no, this is a device that a massage therapist would use um, on a regular massage table. And okay. they would, there's a steam that's pumped into this while the client is in it. Wow. And it helps to detoxify, it helps to relax the muscles. And, and it basically, it's a portable steam room. Love it. Can I have one of those in my house? <laughs> you guys rent these out? <laughs> Okay, usually you think about a typical classroom, desks everywhere. Not so much the case here at Medical Training College because you really want the students to get hands-on. Tell me a little bit about this classroom, right? It's a classroom, huh? Right. This is a classroom. This is where they learn to do the actual hands-on portion of the massage therapy. Um, they work on one another while they're in class and then wow. their clinical portion is the public comes in nice. and they get to act like a real massage therapist and oh. do the massage uh, that they would normally do as a massage therapist once they get out. So how does that work? The public? I mean, can you sign up for this? Because Absolutely. where's the list? <laughs> Absolutely. We do have clinics on Fridays and Saturdays that are open to the public. Wow. You're basically coming in uh, and uh, presenting yourself as like a guinea pig. I love it. And the, <laughs> and the students then um, treat you like a client. Perfect. And they do the massage work with the people that come in and out of the public. I'm here with Ethan Richardson, who's actually going to be combining massage therapy along with physical fitness. Ethan, you want to tell us your plans for after graduation here at Medical, tra medical Training College? Uh, I've got a rough draft. I've um, been doing personal training for a few years now. Uh, I was a strength and conditioning coach before that. And uh, being a strength and conditioning coach and working with uh, high school athletes, I didn't see nearly uh, the same kind of problems that I see with people our age. Yeah. Um, a lot of muscle imbalances and stuff like that, and I just thought massage therapy was a great way to uh, start busting that out. Oh yeah, perfect. I mean, you can you work on your clients right after you get them in shape. They can get a massage from you right after the end of the session, right? Oh yeah, the two definitely go hand in hand. Perfect. Well, good luck on graduation, and uh, we'll be taking appointments. You'll be taking appointments, I'm sure, after you graduate, right? Absolutely. I'll right. be giving you a call. Right. <laughs>
Perfect. It's just another one of the aspects of medical training college. You can become a massage therapist here in less than a year, work in a room, learn exactly what you're going to be doing on the job as a massage therapist in a great facility like this. The best place to get trained in Baton Rouge is right here at Medical Training College.